One of the biggest concerns aspiring pilots face is the ability to secure funds for training. As we know, it can be a big factor in one of the reasons why people just choose to abide on flight training. However, the good thing is, you know, like on this channel, I always try to bring the information, the news, or just anything that can help in your ability to achieve that goal, if that is what you're aspiring to become anyway, become a professional pilot. I try to bring that information to you because I know that, you know, you might not be able to serve everyone, but at least whoever finds it helpful will be able to use it towards that goal. Recently, as I the recording of this video, Boeing released an, a news information that will benefit a lot of aspiring pilots, and that is the scholarship funds of about $950,000 to various organizations that are pretty much supporting and investing in people's trainings for free. It's a scholarship program. So I'll be talking about that in this video. Now, if you're new here, my name is Steven, and on this channel, I talk about aviation and how it benefits you in reaching your goal, you know, how you can achieve your goal as a professional pilot or how you can work towards becoming a professional pilot. And that's really what I share on this channel. So if you're interested in that, don't forget to, you know, subscribe. Don't forget to like, leave your questions, comment section below. I'll try to respond to them. Now, according to the article, Boeing is donating about $500,000 to fund 25 scholarships with five aviation organizations committed to developing future pilots, including Aircraft Owners and Pilots Association, the Latino Pilots Association, the OBAP, which is Organization of Black Aerospace Professional, and uh, we have uh, Sisters of Disguise, and last but not least is Women in Aviation International. The rest of the fund is donated to Fly Company, which is about $450,000, which is a non-profit organization based in Los Angeles. Boeing would generally release articles that predicts or projects the need for flight crew members, which includes pilots and flight attendants and also maintenance personnel. They project the need for this personnel over the course of say 20 years. And they, they try to update this as they have the information. And they have projected that there will be a need for around 602,000 pilots in the next 20 years worldwide. Currently in the US, there are over 600,000 pilots and about 120,000 are working commercially in the aviation, you know, just working commercially as a professional pilot. So in the world, having about 600,000 in the next 20 years says a lot in terms of what the world would need to fly commercially. And this would include, you know, flying passengers, flying business jets, flying charters or private. So in order to support the need for all these pilots in the next 20 years, you know, Boeing is doing their part by supporting uh, these organizations and providing their funds so that they can sponsor people that are aspiring to become pilots. One of the things that I share on this channel is the ability to secure some of these funds. And I've always shared with you guys, there are steps that you can take in order to secure some of these scholarships and there are ways in which you can prepare yourself in order to be able to get the scholarships. It takes some time and effort and of course dedication to the process, but the scholarships are out there and the money is out there. You just need to work harder and smarter in order to be able to tap into these opportunities that are there. You know, my goal for everyone is to be able to achieve this somehow because I know that it costs a lot of money and it takes time. And uh, having these scholarships out there is something that I know will go a long way. The other way that people would often go or the, the routes that people use to raise funds would be to use loans or if you have, if you can get personal loans or student loans, those are ways that people would do that. And of course, the other one that I preach is cater programs that are available as well. As well. Now, those would generally require that you also take on loans, but at least they are usually more structured with a path to, um, to, to a major airline. And those can help. But I believe this is something that I should share with you guys. And I know that if you would want to take it a step further, try to check out these organizations, check out their pages to see when they would have their scholarship windows open. And talking about that, I actually have a video that will be coming out soon in which I'll be sharing the steps I take in order to, or I would take if I was trying to apply for a scholarship and how I would go about 
uh, securing you know a scholarship position if 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 I were to be uh, an aspiring student, so an aspiring pilot, I mean. So that's something that I just wanted to share with you guys quickly and briefly. I hope that you found value in this one. Don't forget to drop a like on it. Again, my goal is to help as much as people as possible because this aviation industry is growing and we need people. So it would be nice to see you in the sky soon.